Hello there, people of YouTube. Welcome back to part two of my Broody Eye Let's Play. I've taken a small moment here to try and see where I left off. It looks like I haven't done too much yet. It's probably moving my Velites over. I'm just going to do a quick glance, start building something. Probably, probably paved roads, actually. Well, I should probably build Temple to Juno here. Yeah, I'm going to make the Temple to Juno. I'll just go ahead and build that for both settlements. Both settlements on the mainland. Apollonia is building a trader. Spy is blocked by this guy. And he still can't get past. Alright. I'm probably... Yeah, I'm going to go ahead and take Thurman this turn. Um... Alright, I'm going to go ahead and start this battle, and then I'll do whatever else I need to do afterwards. Okay. Um, this should be pretty easy. I have five cavalries. Um, they'll make short work of those peltists. Alrighty. Gonna group them up. No towers over here. I like that, so I'm gonna... Okay. Come on. All right, actually, I'm going to do this. 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 All right. Those Peltists are going to be firing pretty much as soon as I get that gate open, maybe even before that. I'm going to rush. I don't normally do this, but um, I'm going to rush my cavalry in as soon as the gates are open and just deal with the Peltists, depending on where these guys are at that time and depending on where the hell their hoplites are and they are in the square so we are all good militia hoplites you'd think they'd give them a little something a little bit of armor but um i guess they are just a militia my velites could probably start firing right now actually let me move them over here And I'm going to. I'm gonna have my cavalry ready to go. Hold up. Yeah, it looks like their peltas are firing already. Why? Oh. Okay. Cool. 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 I'm totally fine with them hitting my velites. I'm totally fine with using them as bait on my on these peltas. My cavalry will make oh I didn't mean to do that. My cavalry will make short work of these guys and then honestly I could just charge my cavalry right into them as well. Probably have my equites take the brunt of it. I'll have my equites at the front right here. The enemy gate is down. Okay, cool. Velites, y'all can chill out. I'm gonna wait for this, and then I will I'm actually I'm gonna go ahead and have my these cavalry ready to go in through here. I'll just have my Hastati charge, have my cavalry charge, have these guys run in here. Just have them. There we go. Uh, hopefully I don't lose any generals here. I shouldn't, honestly. There we go. Perfect. Perfect. I'm going to have my cavalry run down these peltas. Run down these peltas. I'm not going to have them chase the general. No, no, no. Why? 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 Chase the peltas. Chase the peltas. Uh, okay, cool. There we go. Keep going. Keep going. Keep going. You don't have to go. You don't have to go either. All right. All my Hastati can regroup here. They are still holding the battering ram for some reason. Okay. Um. So I can have my Hastati fire. Okay, cool. I'm gonna have two Hastati go this way. 
that's fine. And have them walk. I'll have them walk over here. We'll just have two generals go this way, two generals go this way. I'll have my Velites go too, might as well have them fire into that. No, 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 no. You know what? Just do it. Just do it. Why not? Just do it. I don't care. Yeah, and they're gonna chase that for some reason. Alright, I'm sure that they're going to... Alright, I'm sure that they're going to attack. I'm sure they're going to attack. I'm sure of it. I am sure of it. Have the Hastati move up. Skirmish mode is going to make them be stupid. Actually, they ran away pretty well there. I think... Oh, I have an idea. Okay, move the Velites back. Since these guys want to be dumb and charge the whole way... Why can I not select... Why can I not select my own troops? What is happening? Because there's a building in the way. There's literally a building in the way. Okay, cool. Fire, fire at will, fire at will. Okay, now you go, oh. Oh, that was really good, actually. That was really good. And now they turn back around because they started firing at him. Where's my Equites? I don't want my generals to fight hop, oh, okay. Alrighty, that was good, that was good. Battle of Thurman, done. I'm gonna occupy this. I'm probably gonna occupy all this because I want as much of a population there as possible. Because like I said in the previous video, this is going to be my staging ground for my entire conquest. The Balkans. Love me some Balkans. Going to repair this. Probably Shrine to Mars here, but probably not yet. Um, This is already a town. So, yeah, if I make barracks... I can make militia barracks after that, right after that. So I'm going to make the barracks so that I can do that. Um, Alright, I'll move my Velites there. Let's see what I got here. I got Triarii here, probably for taking Thurman. I'll move them onto the ships. And cool, 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 cool. Let me see what my agents are up to. I only have two agents so far. My diplomat's gonna keep moving north. These are rebels, fairly certain. At Constant or uh, Byzantium. Uh, I'm just gonna have my spies stay there. Doesn't really matter. I did not lose many troops at all. I'm doing pretty good economy wise, so I'll go ahead and make two more. Hastati. And. I'll have these guys start moving down here. Hopefully no ships intercept them. And I think I'm going to end the turn. I was thinking about keeping track of like, you know, turn three, done, turn four, done. But eh, I'll, I'll worry about that later. What are you doing? I don't get what the strategy is here. Why did they have a ship bring a diplomat over here? I don't I don't know, dude. I don't I don't get the AI. I really don't. All right, cool. I'm glad that these guys didn't intercept that. So I'll have these guys do that. I'll have these guys go there. I'll have these guys go back. The shrines are done. These guys are semi-happy again. They are content. See? They are content. Cool. Um, probably make roads next. Yeah, paved roads. Um, I won't need to worry about economy for a good minute, so I'm gonna just try and get a bunch of, um, military-type buildings out of the way. Then again, roads do focus on economy as well, which is cool. Yeah, roads are probably my best bet there. Apollonia... I will make, um, maybe not roads, 
maybe land clearance. Yeah, because I want to boost the population. Okay. Uh, might be able to start having these troops head out south. I want to see if these two are at war with each other. Macedon and Greek cities. I forget how to do that off the top of my head. I think I go here. Yeah. You go here. You can press control three to just instantly bring up that menu and then you hit a uh, diplomatic standing right here. So then hit Macedon and enemy is just rebels. So they are not at war with um they're not at war with the Greek cities yet. Greek cities are at war with all of Rome and the rebels and they have zero trade partners. I'm going to go ahead and move pretty much this whole army. Um, just kidding, I can't do that. I'll wait one more turn because um, I moved these guys down so they're out of points. And I'm going to want my Triarii down here uh, just to deal with any cavalry. I know Macedon has good cavalry, um, more or less. Greek cities also can have good cavalry, but yeah, I'll just want my Triarii so that I can deal with that. I'll have these guys go talk to them, or this guy, not these guys. I'll have this guy go here, see what he can find out. So Macedon already took this, and I don't think I'm at war. No, I'm not at war with Macedon yet. Let me see what my standing is with them, not that it really matters. That's not right. That is also not right. relationship 91 percent we are trading with them um yeah obviously that's gonna drop to zero once i attack them which is going to happen soon i have 563 turns to become the supreme ruler of rome and own at least 50 provinces that will be easy as hell um i'm 95 percent sure that one turn equals six months Yeah, that sounds right. One turn equals six months, I think. All right, and they want me to block blockade Syracuse, which is right here. I'm not going to have to do that because Skibii, fairly certain, will take Syracuse. Um, I think I'm done. Yeah, I think I'm done. I'll make one more Hastati. Should I do that? No, I'm not going to do that. I'll just move this guy up here. They are not happy again, but I don't really care. If they do drop below 70, I'll just change it from high, from very high taxes to high taxes. And then I'll move them over next turn. Alright, I is done. Coming of age. Ah, oh, and I deleted it. Yeah, the delete button is right here. It's right here, and I click that 50% of the time. I love it. Um, so someone came of age. I don't know where. I don't know who. Uh, oh, it was here. I had four generals here. Now I have five. I don't really know or care which one it was. Next. Now I will have them move south and start taking this. That means I'm going to have to, actually I need to move my spy up and see what Macedon has going on up here. Not much it looks like. Yet. Honestly these rebels have more going on up here than Macedon does. Um, I'm going to hit control one, well I think it's control three. Hit Macedon. Yeah, so, yeah, so Mastodon, I just wanted to see the strength comparison so that I could see about how much manpower they have. I don't think this is a measure of just manpower. Um, I'll have to look into that later. 
I'm just gonna make sure they don't have any troops on these uh, on these ships. And I still don't know what they're doing there, but I guess they're warding off potential blockades, even though there's no port here. So no, they're not doing anything. Ready to sail. Um, I will move these two Hastati over. Move you back and move you down. I'm going to move all my troops. Oh, I don't know. Okay. So I don't know if I want to take Larissa first or if I want to take this first. I think I'll take Larissa. I will have my spy further north by that point so I can see what might be coming my way. And then depending on what my spy sees up there, I will go down south and take these three. These three are huge. Sparta, uh, Corinth, and uh, Athens. Big cities. I need to make something here. I will make roads. Oh no, I'm going to make the militia barracks. And then probably roads after that. Well, the thing is, they are not going to be happy once I move my entire garrison out of there. So, I moved them preemptively to low taxes. I'm going to... Move them out of the city, and they are not happy. They're at 22. Oh, I just moved the whole thing by accident. I'm going to leave unit of 70 Velites there, and they're at 52. I'm going to leave probably another Velites because I don't really care much for Velites. All right, cool. So right now I will, um, I should have done this last turn, but I'm going to make a unit of peasants there just to garrison it. And I'm going to do what I said. I'm going to take Larissa, and they'll attack next turn. Um, a shame because I have a, let me see what the standing is with the, so whenever you go to war with someone, just for the hell of it, you should read, um, what, what, how the Senate feels about that particular faction. It's pretty early on. And, um, the thing is, Brutii is pretty much destined to fight Macedon. Brutii is destined to fight everyone in the East and Macedon and Greek cities. So the Senate, I don't think, is ever going to feel too... Uh, they're not going to ever be too against you going to war with one of those. But anyways, I digress. I think I'm going to end the turn now. I'll have him move a little more north. I'll have him loop around this way. I will have you get trade rights with them. See if I can get map information. A most generous proposal. Cool. And I will have you keep moving north. See if I can get trade rights with uh, uh, the Scythians. And then what I generally do is, even as Julia and as Scipii, well, I guess I could. I could have some ships. Okay, once I take this, I'll have some ships take a diplomat over here, as opposed to having my diplomat go all the way around like that, which is what I normally have them do. As Julii, that's what I'd normally have them do, because as Julii, you never have a reason to have ships over here unless you're doing something weird, or if it's late enough in the game. But anyways, I am going to... I am going to... I am going to just end the turn, I think. Uh, I, oh, no, no, that's not mine. Yeah, end turn. I think it is time to take Larissa. You move up here. That's their capital. And I will build uh, roads, probably. Yeah, I'll build roads there. I'll move the Hastati down. And this army right here will be able to take on anything Macedon might send down here. Although I think I'll be able to take this next turn with no no reinforcements from them. Not much to do this turn. Just going to make sure everything is ready for me to end the turn. Scythia is going to be right here. I'm going to start trade with them. Not able to make any merchants yet. I need markets for that.
not gonna make any more hostati at the moment. Um, once these are done, this militia barracks, I'll be able to make them there. Yeah, I think I'm just gonna end the turn. War, too. And I deleted it. Great, who cares? I don't care. The Greek end the bloodshed. Okay. Let me think about this for a second. So they have Sparta. They have Sparta. I need to take Sparta. Um I might do this. I might not. I'm just gonna do it. Take their 10,000. I did it. And basically, I'm gonna try not to attack Sparta for too many turns. Um, or I mean, I'm gonna try not to attack it for the next few turns because I don't want there to be a penalty. Because there's a penalty. If you, if you call a ceasefire and then you attack them again the next turn, there's now a penalty. I'm fairly certain that your reputation would go down. In fact, it might have gone down already. I doubt it, actually. Let me see. Nope. Still good. I'm going to make... I'll probably make traders here now. Yeah, I'll do that. And then maybe markets after that, maybe? Possibly? I don't know. We'll see. I'll make... Uh, I'm not going to make the barracks because... It's only Town Watch that it'll give me, and I don't want Town Watches at all. Shrine of Juno. Um, retrain these. Still building that, and I'm going to do this battle. I was thinking about auto-resolving, re auto but honestly, nah. I'll put my Triarii at the forefront, just mow down those cavalry easily. Over there stands the fearsome Macedonian horde. All right, I'm going to, I'm gonna check out these walls, see if there's a better place to attack from. This looks good, because there's no tower here. Let me see. Yeah, I'll do that. Bring everyone over here. My Velite come. Our soldiers have done their Velites well. come and the start hitting them. The gate. The gods have smiled on us today. The walls are broken. Have them fire at will. They, they should be firing at them. Maybe possibly. The thing is, this is a wall. This is not just a little stockade. So they're gonna have a harder time throwing their stuff over the wall if they even can yeah they can there it is we'll see how much damage that actually does huh not too bad um i'm just gonna see how much damage i can do by throwing stuff at them depending on if they decide to come back over here our troops should be ordered forward just like soldiers have captured the walls now is the time to press on and capture the I don't know place. what the Velites are doing. Okay. You know, I don't care. I'm just going to let that go on. Whatever. I'm going to let them run away. Run away. Yep. Don't go out the gate that's right in front of you or anything. Now you guys can come all the way back here and just get out. Leave the battle. I don't care. These Astadi are out of missiles, so I'm going to trade them out with these. Move, move. 
I'm going to move these guys over here and move these guys over here. And now I'm going to move the Triarii inside. See how that goes. I'm going to move my cavalry here. I'm gonna move. I'm gonna move my equites through these, through these gates because I think if I do that, it'll spur them to start doing something, and I'll actually move my triarii up more. Nope, nothing, because my velites had already taken the gate actually, so I think that's why they're not doing anything. And now they're gonna be stupid and take on my triarii, and then hopefully they do the same. They will. They will do the same. Now I can just have my Equite come in. Or my Cavalry. I'm just going to have them all attack. I'll have these guys move in. Okay. Wow. They flung that guy. I'll have them move in. There. Wow. They're all dead. Okay. I'll just have them all come over here. I'll have them walk. And there it is. Perfect. Yeah, all those casualties I took was from the Velites. That was my fault, because I wasn't paying attention. But uh, I'm just going to occupy this so that I can have more manpower over here, as opposed to bringing it back over here by enslaving. Um, I'm going to start building peasants here because I'm going to want to leave a garrison here while this army goes out and does stuff. What do they have here? Ooh, yeah, see, Macedon has some pretty good cavalry. They have this shot cavalry right here, and then they have this heavy cavalry. But, um, not too worried about this army. This is probably the best army they have. So, now that I know that they have this up here, I'm going to go ahead and move my spy south. I'll make another spy eventually, but I'm going to move him south. And yeah, move my Hastati here. God, that's annoying. I kind of want to take out these rebels, but screw it. I'll just have these guys move to Larissa. Hopefully they don't get attacked by Macedon. Uh, I think I'm done for this turn. Well, let me see. Yeah, I gotta repair the wall, and I'm gonna build barracks for sure, and then militia barracks, and then probably blacksmith. I'm gonna make a shrine to Mars here at Larissa. And then probably at these three as well, I'll make shrines to Mars. Okay, so... That's it. I'm just going to end the turn. Just kidding. I'm going to trade with the Scythians here. Trade map info, map info. A most yes. Generous proposal. And Scythians have quite a bit of map info to offer. No, not really, actually. Um, yeah, they only have this northeast part over here. All right. I'm gonna have to take them on eventually. I'm sure, depending on how far north I decide to go, unless I can keep relations friendly with them, because I would rather focus all my energy over here in Asia Minor. And then over here, obviously, later. But, uh, we'll see. Alright. Next turn. Um... I think I might have changed my mind. I think I'm going to keep my spy up here. Yeah, I'm going to keep my spy here. Keep tabs on this army right here. I'm going to move. I'm going to leave the Velites here. Stupid Velites. How did I lose so many Triarii in that fight? Like, it was just cavalry. I must have... Yeah, it must have been during that last little bit. So I'm going to move these guys down here they're not happy wow they're really not happy um all right that helped 
Oh yeah, I have these guys. And they're still not happy. Hmm. I really could not care less though. Yeah, they might riot, but I'm not terribly concerned. I'll build um I'll build the Shrine to Mars to see if uh, that can help by next turn, but they'll probably end up riding. Oh well. Apollonia, build that. Uh, yeah, I have a lot of money, so I'm going to go ahead and build Hastati here. Hastati, Hastati. Actually, oh no, I can't build a spy here. I was going to build another spy, but I need a market to do that. A market or a trader? I think it's a market. No, no, it's a trader. Nope, it's a market. Because I thought it was a trader for a spy and then a market for a merchant. However, I guess that's not it. Market. Yep, enables training of spy. Oh, well, all right. At Thurman, I will build roads probably. Actually, I'll probably build the... Since I can make a study here now, I will make the Shrine to Mars. And I will raise taxes here for sure. Yeah, because it's going to take me a little while to make these buildings. Okay. I know I'm not playing this perfectly. But, uh... Yeah, I think I'm doing pretty well for, uh... Someone who's played Broody I maybe twice in my life. I'm going to make uh, a Stati here as well. And I'm going to make one more Peasant here. Wait, nope. I already have Peasants going there. Hang on, let me see. Okay, so I can make Mercenary Hoplites. Or I can build them and then Mercenary Peltas. I'm going to go ahead and do this. Oh, they changed that. Interesting. Okay, it might be because this army's right here and it's not letting these mercenaries move out. But usually, when you recruit mercenaries, you should be able to move them. Like, they should have their own set of movement points. But yeah, it must be because this army's right here. Yeah. Okay. Alright, um... I think I'm done with that turn. I'm gonna keep moving this diplomat. I'm just gonna go around. Screw what I said earlier. And I am done. Let me just make sure. Hello. Okay. Yeah, they're not happy, but they'll get over it. I'll uh, move it down if it gets any worse. And then I'll probably build this next turn. That'll help with that. Okay. Cool. And it sounds like I just failed a Senate mission. Um, oh, look at that. I'm going to have to turn around. Alright, so basically... It looks like I'm going to have to turn this around, hit them, they're going to run away. Now I hit them again, and then this battle happens. Okay, so this is a faction leader. Okay. Faction leader with only 47. Well, I guess that's the that's the number, isn't it? Okay. I'm used to uh, bigger unit sizes. I'm going to withdraw from this for now. I'm not going to fight this battle right, right now. I am going to fight it this turn. But uh, I think I'm going to be ending the video now. I am. I am going to be ending the video now. And I want to thank all of you for watching my first two videos in this Eastern Takeover Let's Play. Where I'm playing as the Broody Eye. And I'm going to take over the entire east of the map. Probably end up taking the whole map. But, you know, east first. For obvious reasons. Thank you guys so much again. And... I hope you like, comment, subscribe, comment whatever's on your mind, comment whatever you're thinking, and I will have the next video up for you guys very soon. I'm going to have these videos coming up once or twice, three times, however often I can get them out without, you know, going absolutely nuts. Thank you guys so much.